Hello and welcome to this session. Today we are going to learn how to add our project on Git version control system and this is going to be very easy and very interesting and if you do not have any earlier knowledge on Git, do not worry, this is going to be very easy and we will go very basic step by step and learn how to add project on Git, how to commit and push changes, how to share project with others using Git and finally how to remove the project from git so let's get started and i will open my catalon studio and this catalon studio is open on a mac operating system and i also have this catalon studio here on a windows operating system so you can follow this session on mac as well as on windows so here in the top menu of your catalon studio you will find this git icon however this is disabled so if you are on mac you will go to your catalon studio menu from here and go to preferences and if you are on windows uh, you will go to windows main menu from here and then you will find catalon studio preferences so go to your catalon studio preferences and here under the catalon option if you expand you will get an option for git and here you can enable git integration the same thing i can do on my mac I will find this option under catalon I will find git and here I can say enable git integration apply and ok and then you can see in your main menu bar this git icon is now enabled and then you will find this drop down and here I will click share project and before I click here let me show you what exactly will happen when I click on this share project if I go to the folder containing this project let me open the containing folder of this project and yes so you can see this is the project this is the project folder and as soon as I will uh, share the project on git I will have a empty dot git folder created here so I will go here and say share project and you can see share project is successful and if I go here you can see there is a empty dot git folder uh, sorry this is not empty this is a hidden folder a dot git folder created here and the same thing will happen on windows you will find a hidden folder by the name dot git so this means this project is now being tracked by git so this is the first step and then now we have to add our project to a remote repository so for that what i will do is i will go to github so go to github.com so here is the link go to github.com and here let me sign out I am already signed in let me show you and I will also keep all these links in the notes so that it is easy for you to reference and here when you go to github.com you can create your account by picking a username email and password and sign up so it will create a free account in my case I already have an account so I will sign in and I will use my username or email and password to sign into github uh, let me do it again and yes so you can see now I am signed in on github and you can also sign in and here I can go to this drop down and say new repository or I can also click on this start a project so I will click on start a project and here I can give the repository name so I will say catalon studio sample rest api project you can give any name here i will keep it public because public repositories are free and say create repository so this will generate this repository and this is the link of the repository however this is now empty so now what i will do is next step is i will now again go to my git icon here go to this drop down and this time i will say commit so I will click on commit here and it will show you this window so you can see all these unstaged changes are here and you can select all the uh, files or whatever you want to select you can select as per your requirement and then I can select everything and then drag and drop it to the staged changes areas state changes here yes you can see everything has come here and you can select whatever you want to commit so if you do not want to commit something you can deselect it and then give a commit message I will say this is the first commit 
of REST sample API testing project. Commit messages are important because it will help you to find out what exactly are the changes you did and it will also help others and then I will say commit and push. So here okay this was a system password you may not get that particular step but yes you will get this uh, window here you have to give the URI of the repository so this is the URL of your github repository you can copy it from here and provide it here and then you will provide your github username and password so this one I have used is uh, this one and I will provide the password as well here and I will say next and next and this will push the changes so I will say finish and this is now pushing the changes to remote repositories and let us wait for this to get completed and yes this is done I will say ok and now if I go and refresh my github repository I should see all the project here so you can see everything has come here I can check and you can see this is the first commit of rest sample api testing project which has just done a minute ago and you can also check everything is here if i go to the test cases you can see all the test cases are here and now also uh, this uri this url i can give to anybody so if you also try to clone this project from here you will get my entire project from this url now i have added the project now whenever i will make any change I will commit that change to the remote repository so for example I just add a new test case here I will say test case to demo git commit and I will say ok so this is added here so whenever I will make any change to my project I can go to this git icon and say commit and it will show you whatever is not yet committed so you can see as of now this is the single test case that I created which is not yet committed so I'm just going to drag it to the staged changes and I will say in the message edit test case or I will just say edit test case to demo git commit you can give any message which is meaningful and say commit and push and this should now push the changes to the remote repository I will say ok and this should be done let me just go and check I will refresh this and once I refresh you can see I have got this here just 22 seconds ago edit test case to demo git commit and I can also just go inside the test cases folder and you can see my test case is here so now you can keep your project safe and you can also track the changes using git and now whenever there is anybody new in your team or you want to share your project with anybody you can just share your repository url from here go to your github repository and here you can see clone and download and this is the url so you can just provide this url and that person should have a github account so what he can do is suppose this is a new person uh, where uh, and this is his uh, catalon studio so what he will do is he will just go to this git drop down and now the new person will say clone project so he will click on clone project and he will give this url that you have provided he will give his username of github and password and say next and next and you can see this is the directory where this project will be saved and you can change this so you can also see here uh, as of now the current project is here users Raghav Catalon Studio and this is the clone project which is coming from github which is under Raghav git Catalon Studio sample rest API testing project so I'm going to click finish and this will now open my new project which is now cloned from git and here you can see the location of this project is Raghav git catalon studio sample rest api testing project and you can see the entire project is here all my changes have come here and everything is here so this is how you can share your project with anybody using git and now the last thing we have to discuss is how to remove the project from git now in case you want to delete the repository from github you can 
go to the settings here and if you go down you will find this danger zone where we can delete the repository you can click here delete repository provide your repository name that you have given and this will become activated I understand the consequences delete this repository and you can delete it from here now this will delete the repository from github your remote repository however your project is still being tracked through git so to uh, remove your project from git what you will have to do is just go to the location of your project physical location and then just delete this hidden folder dot git and once you delete this your project will be removed from git so this is how you can remove the project from git and this is how you can use version control system git with your project i hope this session was very useful for you thank you for watching